In this tip of the week, we will look at how to set up a Turnitin assignment. To set up a new Turnitin assignment in your course, go to Assignments, click Add Assignment, and start entering your assignment details. Then, under Submission Type, select Online from the drop-down menu. You can select either File Uploads, Text Entry, or both and a plagiarism review menu will appear below the assignment settings. From the plagiarism review drop-down menu, select Turnitin. This will allow the Turnitin settings menu to appear. Store submissions in allows you to choose whether or not you wish to have the papers for this assignment stored in the repository for future submissions to be checked against. You may choose not to store the submitted papers, such as if the assignment is a draft version and you do not want the final paper to be compared against the draft version resulting in a high similarity report. Compare submissions against allows you to select what content you want the student submission to be compared against. Similarity report allows you to select options related to the similarity report feedback. You can choose elements you wish to exclude from the results, such as bibliographic materials or small sources. If you choose to exclude small sources, you can set a threshold word count to exclude, such as two or three words. If you choose to enable the Educational Testing Service ETS Handbook for grammar checking, then you can select the feedback you wish to automatically display for students when the similarity report is generated. You or the student can enable or disable any of the ETS feedback categories when viewing the results of the similarity report in Turnitin Feedback Studio, but this option allows you to set default results. You have the option to save the settings you choose as the default settings for any future Turnitin assignments by checking next to Save as Default Settings. You can then decide when to show the originality report to students either immediately upon submission, after the due date, after the assignment is graded, or you can choose to hide results from students altogether. Since the plagiarism framework for Turnitin is included with the assignment settings, you can use all the features of a Canvas assignment, such as rubrics, the ability to resubmit the assignment, making the submission a group assignment, or requiring peer reviews. When you are done adding assignment details, press Save or Save and Publish to retain your changes. It is important for all faculty to include the Turnitin statement in their syllabus, even if the originality report is not shown to students. Students must agree to the plagiarism and user license agreement whether you choose to show the originality report to the students or not. However, the system does not verify that they open and read the Turnitin user agreement. Including the Turnitin statement in your syllabus informs the student that this is the tool that they are consenting to use when they check this box. Thank you for watching this tip of the week. For more information, please refer to the following resources.